how to reactivate Facebook Lite account. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's guide video, I'll simply guide you through the steps on how you can reactivate your Facebook Lite account. So just make sure to watch the video till the end. Now reactivating your Facebook Lite account basically means reactivating your overall Facebook Meta account in itself. So it's not just Facebook Lite because Facebook Lite is only just an application that you can use on Android devices to help you consume less data. But anyway, I will show you the process from my Facebook Lite app itself since that is what you're looking for what I need to do is I just need to go ahead and launch a Facebook Lite app so remember this is the Facebook Lite app I'm going to open it up and I have actually deactivated my account before and if I want to reactivate it I just have to go about logging into the same account yes it's as simple as that you just need to try to log into your account in itself and sometimes it may ask you for a pop-up whether or not you want to reactivate you can select the reactivate button or else you can just log in automatically so in my case my account is already saved so i'm just going to select that and as you can see in this case it'll ask me to enter my password so let me go ahead and do that as well and once i've entered the password i just need to tap the little login button as you can see so here it says two-factor authentication request so i'll just tap on ok and here you, as you can see i received a specific code i'm going to do that and then once i've done that i just need to go ahead and then actually paste that specific qr code or that number in this case and then i also need to make sure to enter my mobile number so let me go ahead and do that too once I verify these details, again, I just need to tap the option called login over here. Once I tap the login option, it might ask me that my phone number is correct or not. Then after that, you can see my account will be successfully reactivated without doing anything. So this way, I can go ahead and then reactivate my Facebook account. Hope this video was helpful to you guys. If it did help you, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have got any more questions, then feel free to leave them down. Thank you for watching till the end and see you in the next video.